This month's tooltip is on Reshape Object. Select your object and select the Reshape Object icon. This allows me the opportunity to change the stitch angle, the entry, needle entry, and needle exit points of the design. Enter will let those changes take effect. I can also change the control points. I have two types of control points, corners, which are the squares, and curves, which are the circles. I can move or add control points. To add a control point, I just click along the outline. Left click creates corner points. Enter lets those take effect. Right click generate curved lines and an enter lets that take effect. I can change a curve to a corner with a space bar. Tap the space bar and hit enter. I can change also the corner to a curve the same way with the space bar. Enter. Move your control point and enter on the keyboard. It's also nice to change different angles of your outlines. If I select the outline and reshape object, let me zoom in so you can see the satin stitching here. You want to make sure that you have a single corner point for satin stitching. For blanket outline, sometimes it's nice to have two corner points and you'll watch as we place two corner points with a left click and enter on the keyboard to get much shorter blanket stitches around that corner at the top of the heart. If you find that you have too many control points in an object, go to Edit and Smooth Curves. This brings up the dialog box where you can enter precision like one millimeter. Say OK and the number of control points of the object will be reduced.